So what's happening that's new in California? It's raining ashes. There are hundreds of wildfires happening, 367 fires to be exact. So what caused the fires? The state was hit with thousands of lightning strikes, and when you combine that with a heat wave and furious winds, you get a spread of fires that covers around 46,000 acres and leaves tens of thousands to flee their homes. So Kelsey, did you know the lack of backup from crews made up of prisoners has also hindered the firefighting effort because the inmates are actually locked down in jail due to COVID, so they need the help. That's crazy, I didn't know that. Joe Biden received backlash from environmentalists and had to restate his commitment to ending fossil fuel subsidies. This commitment is a big part of Biden's climate plan and a point of emphasis for his campaign to the presidency. This goes directly against President Trump's ideas. Any surprise there? No. Greenpeace, an environmental organization, gave Biden and Harris a B plus grade while Trump received an F. Again, not surprised. Anyone looking for another reason to question the tech that's coming out of China? Well, Taiwan doesn't need another one. They are locking out the Chinese video streaming services Baidu and Tencent. What's weird about this is that it was already illegal, but these companies were operating under a legal loophole that allowed them to partner with local companies. Huh? I don't even get it. Taiwan has a complicated political system that dates back to the Chinese Civil War. In all your travels, have you been to Taiwan? I have not. Uh, me neither. I, I've never been to Asia, but that, it sounds fun. Asia's fun. So the TikTok mansion known as Sway House, located in LA, has not been following social distancing orders after continuing to throw massive parties despite public health orders. Police have showed up to the door at least twice, attempting to get TikTok stars Bryce Hall, Noah Beck, and Blake Gray to stop throwing parties, but have continued to disrespect the law. The LA mayor gave the okay to shut down the mansion's utilities, leaving the young crowd to go home and party in the dark without electricity or water. So have you ever partied in the dark? Of course I have. It's the only way to party. I don't really I know, even know right? what the big deal is. I mean, is. it could have made their party even more fun. I agree. 90s pop star Mariah Carey is back in action with a brand new album called The Rarities that is getting released on October 2nd. I've got to say, Mariah Carey, after 20 years since Heartbreak with Jay-Z, she looks pretty freaking good. What do you think, Cliff? Uh, yeah, Heartbreak's a good song too, but come on, Always Be My Baby. I love that song too. Mm -hmm. Number one. Mm -hmm. Number one in my heart. We reported on this last week, but it's official. Lyft is going MIA in California as of midnight tonight due to the court granting drivers to be classified as employees rather than contractors. Uber and Lyft let contractors know last week that they will likely comply with California's demands. Which means restructuring operations and rehiring employees. Hey guys, so we announced today on Iblebits that Lyft and Uber was gonna be banned from California and that's not the case anymore. The court just decided to give them a reprieve. So we will keep you guys updated on the story. So what do you think about this whole employee and contractor situation with Lyft? Well, I know that uh, my last driver, he didn't speak much English, he just barked a lot. <laughs> That's really my main concern. Oh, wouldn't you want Pickles as a driver? Look at that. I mean, can you imagine him just driving you around? Oh, look at that. Thank you so much for tapping into the Daily News with us. My name is Kelsey Cosmala. I'm Cliff. And we go over the top trending news stories of the day real, real fast. The quickest news on YouTube. So smash that subscribe button, hit like, and watch us tomorrow. Bye-bye. See you later.